According to a traditional Chinese culture, the world is composed of five elements, namely metal, wood, water, fire, and earth. There are supportive and destructive relationships among them. For example, wood generates fire, fire generates earth, earth generates metal, metal generates water, water generates wood. This supportive cycle is mutually beneficial. At the same time, there are destructive relationships among them. For example, wood subdues earth, earth subdues water, water subdues fire, fire subdues metal, metal subdues wood. The destructive cycle brings about mutual harm and disadvantages. The supportive relationship of the five elements is like the mother giving birth to the son, showing support and representing balance and good luck. The destructive relationship of the five elements is like a wall, symbolizing mutual hostility. The supportive relationship of the five elements is expressed by following. Wood generates fire, since wood is used as fuel, when wood is burned out, fire would die automatically. Fire generates earth, objects burned out by fire would turn into ash, which is the earth. Earth generates metal. Metal is within the earth and stones and cannot be extracted unless it is smelted. Metal generates water. Metal, after having been burned, would turn into liquid, which is water. Water needs to be guided by what metal where. Water generates wood. Water can irrigate trees, making them grow. The destructive relationship of the five elements is expressed by the following. Wood subdues earth. Without plants, there will be water loss and soil erosion. Fire subdues metal. Fierce fire can melt metal. Earth subdues water. Earth can cover water. Metal subdues wood. Metal cutters can saw trees. Water subdues fire. Water can put out fire. Among the 12 animal signs, wood corresponds to the tiger and the rabbit. Fire corresponds to the horse and the snake. Water corresponds to the rat and the pig. Metal corresponds to the monkey and the roaster. Earth corresponds to the ox, the dragon, the sheep, and the dog. Observing and getting to know the twelve animal signs serve to recognize the original ideas of ancient people in establish them later. Common folks in China divided these animal signs into yin and yang so as to correspond to the five elements. There are also supportive and destructive relationships within yin and yang and the five elements of the twelve animal signs which I will explain in future lessons. Thank you very much for watching.